What's up, guys? Thanks a lot for stopping by. I hope you're doing good. So, I just want to do a, a quick intro. Considering you're probably thinking, what the hell's going on? This isn't Valheim. Um, basically, uh, for a long time now, I'll just explain the whole thing. Um, first of all, if anyone's watching this and they're, they're not somebody uh, who's already a regular to the content, welcome. Thanks for stopping by. Um, my primary uh, game that I actually play is Valheim. And I have multiple world records. I've got four current world records in Valheim, over a dozen previous world records. And uh, we grind for a lot of Valheim speedruns, but I also make Valheim guides and tutorials. And I make Valheim challenge videos, like with the uh, first person to uh, beat the game in reverse, for example. Let me just go to this or something. Um, yeah, so I make guides and uh, speedrun videos, challenge videos, stuff like that. And I've uh, been absolutely loving doing that, but I'm interested in kind of like branching out into other games as well. Um, maybe with the idea of making guides, speedruns, and challenge videos for those games as well. So I do also speedrun Tribes of Midgard. I'm totally new to speedrunning in like the last six months or so. Um, like Valheim is just the game that uh, got me into speedrunning. Um, but anyway, I've been a huge fan of the Resident Evil games for a long time. Like several nights a week, I'll be falling asleep literally just to watching like raw gameplay footage of these games. I'm so nostalgic about it. Some of my favorite streamers are Resident Evil streamers, and I love watching Resident Evil speedruns. And I've always, um, I've always, um, wait, what's going on with my stream right now? I think everything's good. I've always wanted to uh, try and speedrun Resident Evil games. Like in high school, I used to play these games pretty much every weekend with my friends and stuff. Um, so I'm a huge Resident Evil fan. The restream right now is telling me that my bit rate can't reach some platforms or something. I hope everything's good with the stream. Um, so anyway, for a while I've been uh, experimenting, uh, trying to learn other speedrun games off stream. Um, and, uh, you know, I haven't really managed to get that many successful runs in in any game other than Valheim um, or Tribes of Midgard. Um, but uh, I was trying to learn the Resident Evil 1 remake because uh, it's one of my favorite games ever. And recently, I uh, played through all the OG Resident Evil games again. And I actually found that I was playing so much better in this game, I was finding it a lot easier to remember where to go. So just a couple of nights ago, I uh, decided I would start trying to learn the speedrun route for this game. And like, Pretty quickly, um, I was doing much better. And so, not last night, the night before, I managed to do a run where I just died on the final boss. I messed something up. Um, and then last night, I managed to get my first ever successful run. And I, and I started playing it today, just to see if I could still remember where to go. And I almost PB'd, but I'd made a stupid mistake and died. And so, I was... Um, going to kind of save these runs for Halloween because I've been planning on streaming some other games for Halloween. Um, so this is an announcement, I suppose, that on Halloween I'm going to be playing Resident Evil games all day. But I've managed to learn this run so far, like much faster than I thought I would. And so I kind of, if we're going to be PB and I might as well be streaming it. And uh, I kind of do just need to uh, um, freaking uh, 
do these runs whilst it's fresh in my head. Is the stream actually running okay for everybody? The stream is telling me your stream can't reach the following platforms. YouTube and Twitch. Downscale of video settings and streaming software. I don't understand. Oh, what's up, Nell? Thanks for stopping by. I hope you're doing good. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, it seems to be working all right, right? I don't know why it keeps telling me that. All right, so um, so the plan today... I'm a little bit nervous, I'll be honest, guys. I need to relax. My plan today is... Uh, look, I, I was trying to keep it a surprise for everybody. I was going to stream Resident Evil games for Halloween. I was going to try and do a really long stream and just play Resident Evil all day. Um, but I'm so close to getting like a pretty good time. Considering right now I have one successful run of this game. And it's an hour and two minutes and four seconds, right? It was good. My next run, like, uh, was almost, it was definitely going to be under an hour if I got it successfully. So, like, my time is getting to be decent enough to do streams so quickly that I was like, holy shit, I kind of need to stream this whilst it's fresh in my head. Um, so, anyway, we're go uh, the reason I'm nervous is because I'm fucking a huge fan of watching this for some reason. I've always wanted to do Resident Evil speedruns. And I never thought I would for some reason. I don't know why. And I'm feeling like we're getting there. So I'm hyped. Um, so yeah, like before I jump into it, I know I've been talking for ages now. Hope you're on a nice day, by the way, now. Um, oh, I will, so I'll, I'm going to stream this today until I have a new PB. And then we're going to move on to Valheim. So as long as I have... Um, as long as I have enough time to do some more sub 90 Valheim runs, I just want uh, the reason I'm streaming this right now is because I'm so close to PB. I just want to get a PB and then we'll move on to Valheim. All right, so this might be a short stream. Um, we'll see. Uh, and then we'll then, then I'll do a Valheim stream afterwards. So I do still plan to do Valheim today, just in case anyone's worried. I just want to get this done first. Last thing before I jump into it that's kind of cool that I want to explain is this game has auto splits. So the splits above me here, um, like it actually auto the game automatically is going to do different splits and stuff. So I know I don't actually have to press the button. So you're going to see a lot more splits. Um, and also, uh, yeah, the like something awesome the speedrun community of this game has done is Gemini. Who's a legend? Shout out to Gemini. Um, basically, this is a modded version of the game that enforces some of the speedrun rules, which is amazing. But as usual, there's a link in the description to the speedrun page. All right. Yeah, this is going to be. I've actually been having so much fun doing this now, so I'm hyped. So I might um, be slightly less talkative than usual because there's so much shit to remember, and I'll try and explain it as much as I can. But I'm just going to be trying to get a PB and then we'll do some Valheim. The last thing, obviously, it's kind of obvious, but I guess I need to address it. Yeah, we've got a completely different stream layout because this is my layout that I've made. It's a work in progress, so I hope you guys like it. But um, I've been working on this for a while, on and off, um, to get a good layout for playing like games that are like four by three, you know, where, where it's just like square games. But yeah, you can see my logo, my splits and stuff above me. I've got a nice kind of uh, pixel art style uh, chat box that appears above my head as well. All right, that's enough talking. Let's go. I need to not be nervous. <laughs> I lasted two seconds and I walked straight into a zombie. <laughs> Thanks, gentle. Thanks for, for watching. Hope you're doing good, dude. Which 
try again. So the good thing about this game, even though I have to concentrate, Freeze. there's loads of unskippable cutscenes that we get to what enjoy together that are hilarious because they're fire. super goofy dialogue that's hilarious. We can talk during these cutscenes just fine. So Sorry. this is my first game that isn't them. some precisely generated game. What's going on in this town? So it is all about lines. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed and routes was wrong, the entire and just trying to play perfect with zombies. That's Kendo. Legendary character. What's up, Dory? Thanks for stopping by the stream. Hope you're doing good, dude. No, he didn't. Trying to save bullets. So at that bit, basically, if you shoot him in the leg, sometimes he can fall back and it allows you to run through him more. He didn't do it then. Obviously, I'm new to this speedrun, so... Probably did something wrong. Oh, you can sometimes get a dodge there without that happening. It's okay. There's so much time save in my current PB that we can afford a lot of mistakes right now. See, I don't know why she's not dying to that now. At least this guy did get knocked back. So, like, if you shoot her three times... He should not grab you, which saves a bit of time. I'm great, thanks, Doru. What's up, Baba? Thanks for the stream. Hope you're doing good. Everyone's favorite police officer. Marvin coming up. I'm fine, thanks. Hope you're all as well. Nice to see this game destroyed. It was my first horror game back in the day. Oh, awesome. I'm a huge Resident Evil fan, guys. Like, I'm brand new to Resident Evil speedrunning. This is my first, like, real Resident Evil 2 speedrun stream. But I am a huge fan of these games. What uh, happened? So the plan, Doru, is... Uh, there was this I just want a PB in this game, which should be pretty easy. And then we'll move on to try to get PB in Valheim. So, as long as we have time, I'll I will do uh, and the other stars members discovered that some Valheim runs tonight as well. Was behind everything. Thanks for the look, dude. I appreciate it. Thanks for the follow, truth. Baba. But no one believed them. Not long after that, all this started to happen. Uh, uh, guys, thank you so there. much for, for showing up for my first me? ever Resident Evil 2 speedrun stream. You guys are legends. In the other rooms. I've literally got one successful run in this game, okay? So Take this key card. I'm learning, but you we can do it. To unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But just go. I love this game. Fine, but I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. So on Halloween, I'm going to do Resident Evil runs. And not just speed runs, but, but casual runs all day. We might even play Kendo's Cut, the Resident Evil 2 mod. Thanks, Doru. Appreciate that. Ah, you gotta press confirm on that. Yeah, still learning this stuff. The main thing right now, guys, considering I've only got one successful run, is honestly, 
I'm happy as long as I remember the route. <laughs> That's the only thing I'm concerned with, really. But we might do a story playthrough on Halloween as well. For people that haven't seen the game. To see all the cutscenes. Got to get a dodge here, and that's not too bad. Do 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 do. Alright, watch this. One, two, three. We're still getting greens, so on track to PB right now. World record's about 48 minutes in this game. For anyone watching that might not know. My PB. Is that see on the screen? Leon. It's good to see you're still among the living. Wait, why does that PB it say 54 like minutes? My, my PB is uh, 102. 04. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's you can see it at the end split. Any survivors and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Here's Take a radio. It. Look at this amazing animation. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Why is the idea to always split up? In any horror thing ever. I know. Let's split up. Wait, what? No? Let's not split up. How about no? Okay, we do that three times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I think that's right. Come on, Leon. Alright, we Gucci. No, we went the wrong way. No, that was a mistake. That's going to cost us. Shall I reset? I don't think we have to reset. I knew I was doing that wrong. You're supposed to go to the back wall. I don't even know why I did that. I oh, see we still did this corridor way better than on my pre previous PB, so... Oh, God. That's probably eat that herb on the way back or something. I took over the wrong line there to avoid getting hit. Hopefully I don't die to this liquor. I'll try not to do heavy resets because I'm, I I need to practice the whole route, you know what I mean? We're so far from having to reset all the time right now. I've got loads of time to save in my PB. Really just focusing not to die there. It's a terrible line, but okay. <laughs> low HP already so one other thing about doing this quickly is not taking damage basically so you don't have to heal all right we made it through there I'm gonna it's gonna be worth it to just heal because I think we'll move faster. I think. I think orange ca caution slows you down, but maybe yellow doesn't. 
could be wrong about that. I love the music in this game, it's so good. Right now we collect the silver gem. Something we prepared earlier. Can I get this right? Oh, hell yeah. I messed up that line on my PB and uh, got bit, so. I think that might have just been faster as well than my PB because I always forget I'm about to enter the library and just run out instead of turn in. Oh no, I got stuck. Shit. It's all good though. Should still be faster, I think. I don't have my splits like right next to me like I normally do doing this because it doesn't matter that much right now. And just if I play better, it will be faster. I just know that. So I'll glance over when we go cutscenes, check how we're doing. But I can see we've got some greens. Just need to chill, have a good time. Honestly, the hardest part is kind of all in the RPD and stuff. I'll be able to relax a lot more soon. This way. Oh, there's a different line that I was thinking about taking out here. Famous Crow Corridor. Oh, shit. Bow, bow. Alright, I'm gonna do a dodge here. Oh god, I almost messed that up. Man. I do love this game. I'm enjoying, I'm so happy to be actually doing a stream of speedrunning Resident Evil, guys. I've always wanted to do this. Can I, ah, I went for it. I don't, I, I need to learn what line you're supposed to take to not get bit there. Because I know, I, there's a way I can do it and not take damage, but it's kind of slow. Like, some of the positions of enemies and stuff as well are a little bit RNG, so... That should be a lot faster. by about eight seconds right now. Go left side to dodge this guy. Oh god, I'm stuck. Right side to this guy. Hopefully all these seconds just add up, you know? I want to save about three minutes. Oh, shit. That cutscene is so short. Messes me up every time. Alright, 
right, we need to turn a bit. Now we go on the other side. Oh, it's looking good. So far, chat. Now we go down the lattice, right? I just got to remember the route. Like, this is really a test of can I actually remember where to go under pressure on the stream? There's so much green coming. It should be good. I hope so. Appreciate the support, dude. As long as we don't die. <laughs> as long as we don't die, we'll be fine. Um, oh, God. We, we don't want another hit from that liquor. That's for sure. It'll slow us way down. Lickers are still like one of the scariest enemies in any game ever. Freaking awesome. No, I did that wrong again. I do this wrong every time. Right, this is sketch. No, we got good RNG there. No! I fucked it up massively, chat. We're dead. Don't think we can get out of this situation. Yeah. GG. Do you know what? What happened was I'm so used to getting bad RNG in that room where the zombie ends up being right in front of me. That like I, I'm unable to avoid getting bitten usually. But if you get good RNG, you don't have to stop or anything. You can just run around. And we got the good RNG, but I stopped to shoot. Which I only stop and shoot when we get the bad RNG. So I'm just too used to bad RNG. We actually got too good RNG there. Biohazard. Just not used to it going that well. A good RNG there as well. Zombie placement's better. We actually got a green on that, which that was actually Who are you? That's actually what are good. You doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human. So this guy's a legendary character, Sorry. and there is a mod. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this so town? The mod is basically like what what happens if Kendo survives. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something And it's wrong, amazing. It's called Kendo's Cut. And we're going to be playing it on Halloween. Zombies. Cuz Kendo unfortunately doesn't make it. <laughs> As we hear right now. Rip Kendo. F's in the chat for Kendo. The legend. Oh. Oh, we almost got that right. This is hard, like legit. That's hard that bit. But that was pretty good. I see runners like mess that bit up all the time. Legitimately difficult that bit. Can we get a dodge here this time? Yes, we can. That's better. Now, can I? Why should she, uh, Just bad RNG. That was bad RNG. He can die after three shots, and he can get not knocked back a little bit after one. Didn't happen for us there. Still 
Still getting greens though. That little beginning bit was not bad actually on my PB. Done like oh, I've done less than ten runs of this you game. The new guy, Leon. Probably. Sorry, I've only got one successful run. That's my PB. Like your party has been cancelled. What? I happened? recorded that last night. I kind of, kind of, it ago, snuck on up on me how like how fast we're progressing on this game. So that's why I just spontaneously decided to stream it. In a mansion located in the outskirts of this city, Chris. And the other STARS members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the That's truth. That's why I decided to start streaming it. I was trying to learn the run in time for Halloween, but I was like, considering it's that, going so well, I think I should just stream it whilst it's fresh in my head. Uh, uh, but hang in there. Don't worry about me. It's not last place just on the leaderboard if I submitted that time. Rules. I'll put it like that. Here. And, and, and like, card. I think I can save you three minutes the doors in the really hall quick this. as well. Now go, but like, just getting go. close to having a pretty good time, like pretty quickly. So, Fine. but I'm coming back for maybe you. one day just I will actually on. grind it a bit more seriously. Right now, it's just about self improvement, you know, having a good time. I think I gotta press confirm I'm back to get out of this quickly. Yeah. That might be a little bit faster. Some of the cutscenes on that script give him fast enough either. Forgot where we're up to then for a second. Well, which time going up and down this corridor is this? This is the first time, right? <laughs> Well, this is how we're going to mess up. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Got to turn a bit so I don't run into this zombie. So clear. Neon. Neon. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not gonna find your brother here after all. What's up, Bevo? Thanks for stopping by. I hope you're doing good. I'm having a great day, thanks. Yeah, I've been busy. <laughs> There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up. Look for any survivors. I've been grinding so many other games to try and figure out the speed run. It right. takes a while one to select the next one, but Here's super ring. happy with it being Take this it. one. So now I can that officially speed run three games. All right, we turn a little bit. Oh God. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, let's go, Brit.
Right, we go to the back wall. Mm. There we go. Much better. Do, 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 do. Oh. Shit. Mm. We just YOLO this. Mm. Alright, yeah, that's way faster than PB at that corridor, I think. I think we go left there, actually. That's how we don't get hit. That's the first time I remembered to do that, I think. Am I tripping or are we saving even more time this time? I think we are. That's all of them. What's up, Cammy? Thanks for stopping by. I hope you're doing good. Also, a good chat. I just want to get a PB in this game, guys, and then we'll go for PB in Valheim again. Much better. Poke this wall. No. Oh, it's okay. Yeah, sometimes I mess that up. It's, honestly, usually I don't manage to get that dodge. It's just the last couple of times I managed to do it super well. Oh, I messed up this again. Still going to be better than my PB. Honestly, there's a certain point, right, where we're guaranteed to save like three minutes. Because on my PB, I almost died a couple of times. And I ended up having to heal. And get more bullets to shoot zombies. So at this point with me learning the speed run, it's more about I'm just happy if I remember the route and actually just survive. time did it did it did it This bit makes me nervous every time. 
need to go for a different line this time on the way back. What are we going to do? We go past the lamppost. See, I, I, maybe that's the way to do it. I'm not 100% sure. I'm sure there's a faster way. Like we're so far away from the uh, me doing these runs being all about my lines and everything. It's just about the route at this point. But lines in in rooms where a good line can make you not die or not get bit. It's worth learning at this point. side to dodge I think we're saving a lot more time than on the last run right Hell yeah. Ugh. Shit, I forgot we need to go on the other side. I appreciate that. Shit, that jams a lot. Right, that was way better. Hope for good RNG here, I guess. No, I did a wide line. We got good RNG, but I did a wide line. Alright, we just. No! I keep messing up my, my lines in this room for some reason. I've never done. Never messed up so bad in this room. I can never dodge Marvin either, so. Why is he trying to shoot him even? Nah, he doesn't get. He didn't get knocked back. If he got knocked back, that could have been worth it. Perhaps. Still looking good, though. Right, we're approaching the bit. Nice, we dodged. We're approaching the bit where we're like guaranteed several minutes of time save if I don't mess it up. Do I go for this? No, it's too late. We don't go for that. We don't need that. 
don't need that. Hesitated. We'll heal if we need to at some point. Oh, what? First time I've ever been hit in this corridor on the speed run. <laughs> Here we go. Legendary character. Hell yeah. Sorry about that. When I saw the uniform, I thought you were another zombie. Who are you? Ada Wong. And what are you doing here? I'm looking for some guy named Ben. He's one of those reporter types, always looking for a scoop. I heard he was locked up in the cell block, only there's a wrecked car barring the entrance. I've been trying to find another way inside. If we work together, we can move this thing. Give me a hand here, will you? I love the story and stuff in this game. It's actually kind of good that you can't skip all of the in engine cutscenes on this speedrun because it means your chat actually gets to watch them. <laughs> Like we do skip all the FMVs, obviously, but. Ada, wait! Bow, 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 bow. That was the sound, by the way, guys. Can you hear the thing, game okay? Right? Get up now. What do you want? I'm trying to sleep here. Is this the guy? Ben? You told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on, didn't you? What did you tell them? Nice, thanks, dude. And who the heck are you? I'm trying to find my boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella, based in Chicago, but he suddenly disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. What was that? What was that? Like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But... Do you even know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. It won't be easy. All right, I'm going. Hey, do wait. <laughs> All right. So the being really fast at menuing is like, oh fucking, I did this again. I always forget that that you, you stay on the inventory there. Being fast at menuing is a huge part of being good at this game, speedrun wise. Alright, we didn't take any damage from the spiders, so that's good. Messing up here. I'm messing up. 
I did this on my PB though, so it's fine. We're getting confused. There's another bit where I have to equip a different gun at that door, but that isn't it. That's not the bit. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. It's a dead end. So when we change to Ada here, get upstairs through this shaft. we only equip the pistol, I think, because I, I believe Ada runs faster, a lot faster without the pistol. Which is a pretty cool little trick. Got good RNG with the dogs there. Right, I always mess this bit up. So, you don't have to push these all the way in. You can save time as long as they're at a certain position. They'll automatically move. All right, that was much better than I've done it so far. See, look, they just slide in. You have to get them in a certain spot, otherwise it won't work. It's another cool little speedrun trick. So far, so good. Leon, Minus 32 seconds so far. Holy shit. Ada, did you find anything? Right here. We're not even getting started on a real time save yet. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation. Just don't die. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! I caught the thing. I still not good enough at this game to guarantee not dying. Oh no. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Oh no. We hit. Oh fuck. We might be dead. It's a little bit RNG like what these spiders actually do. Where's the next heal? Oh fuck. We're dead. How can we do this? There might be a green herb over here, actually. Something much worse than this happened on my PB, so... Alright, we might be alright. Just don't get hit by this freaking liquor. Ugh. Oh, we got hit, but we're alright. Because we just healed. Magnum. Oh, there's that silver herb still there. 
Right, I'm going this way. It's safer. It's, it's slower, but it's safer. Did I just go the wrong way? No, this is the right way. I went on my menu because I wasn't sure there. You can run past this guy, but I never can manage it. So this is, I'm terrible at this bit. He's not, he's not getting knocked back at all for some reason. I think I'm dead. No. We gotta shoot this guy. No! No, the auto aim screwed us. Oh my god, we're barely making it. We're barely making it. Almost this exact same thing happened on my PB, I'm not gonna lie. So I think we already got the major time save. Yeah, we did. Because what happened on the my PB was that horde that I managed to run through. I was on danger at that point. So I had to shoot him. Which meant I had to go back for bullets. So we're winning right now, chat. All right. I don't know. I, I can never. I've never been good at dodging in this corridor. Oh, well, at least I dodged that guy. I'm stuck. Trying to remember where we actually go here. I think we go up, right? This is the most crucial part. This speedrun stream is me remembering the route. Yeah, we got the cog for the clock tower. So that means we go in here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember. So my goal on this run is to try and save about three minutes. I'll be so happy if I can PB by about three minutes. That would be just epic. Sub one hour really is what I want at this point. That would be awesome. My second successful run being sub one hour. That would be epic. Mess up the menu in a little bit because I was thinking, oh, I should equip the Magnum. But I was thinking, oh, do I get a chance to do it before or after the animation? And it... No, no. I messed up. <laughs> if you got tell, I messed up. Supposed to use the cog before you click on it. All right, boss fight time. No! Get away!
I almost went the wrong way. Ben! Can you still hear me? Come on, answer! Damn! I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <laughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police. A co-conspirator. One of the best lines in the game. Get Are you ready? That scum. <laughs> Make, Make him, him pay. pay. Hang in there, Ben. Get that oh. scum. Make him pay, chat. My chest. It's burning. Just amazing script writing. I love it. I love this bit. Ada's just like, what was that? God, what was that? <laughs> Like, it's even casual. It's so fucked up. It's just mega casual about it. Where are you going, Ada? To the chemical plant. I have a feeling that's where I'll find John. Ada, wait. Hey. Hey. Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? All right, let's go. We can do this. True. There's nothing for Ada. Experience spy. We really didn't take damage, that's good. Here we go. Birkin fight number one. I'm not sure if it's random how many bullets he can take, actually. I swear he was dead. Oh, I was done with it there. I think I've got less bullets. Shit. Wait, how many bullets do I have in this pistol, chat? I had to shoot, right? Well, we're, we're yolo in it either way. I'm not stopping to check. I think I used some extra pistol bullets, right? We might be... Nah. As long as we got one bullet in the chamber, I think we'll be okay. <laughs> I was there, Leon. I know. Look, Ada. As an officer, it's my job to look out for you. This We're whole segment's so crazy, by the way. We don't work together. Well, there's like so much action in such a short right. period of time in this we'll part of the game. this way I always forget that corridor or well, that room sorry Heads up. Leon that woman was I have to talk to her all right eight at a time I messed up again a little bit there all good though That was better than my last run.
Don't move. You're the one who's with that cup, if I'm not mistaken. So this is the part of the game where you actually find out how the T-Virus was Ada? Ada bred in the first place. Ada Wong. I've heard that name Unfortunately, before. we will be skipping the actual no, real cutscene for it, but... One of the men from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research... Awesome part of the game. Name as his password. Ada and John, I believe. How did you know? Who are you? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus. William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this, you will be joining him shortly. I won't let anyone take the G-Virus away from me. G-Virus? Definitely a little bit harder on stream as usual, but things are still going really good. The potential is even greater than that of the T-Virus. Then that must mean the creature in the police department is precisely my husband, William. And it's all Umbrella's fault. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. Make sure I skip this cutscene. So those Didn't even see it, bro. Carriers of the virus. Faster skip of ever. Virus induced transmutation. Legit, legit probably saved a, a fraction of time there. Cause I think I let, or like, I think I didn't, I wasn't spamming it fast enough. My PB. And create offspring. No. Too bad. Too bad. Cold as ice as usual, Ada. Uh oh. Alright, let's do this. That was a better line than last time on my PB. I'm gonna go a bit wider so I avoid damage from that spider because he's such an asshole. I always take damage from him and we just didn't, so that's better. Oh god, don't poison me, don't poison me. No, we're good better RNG with the spider placement there as well. So we do this so we can cross. Then we do it again to save time later. I think I had to heal here on my PB as well, which I'm not going to do now. Because we're, we don't need to. So we just save time by doing that. Again there. <laughs> this boss is so funny, honestly. Get ready for the hardest boss fight in video games ever. I'm not joking, guys. Oh, hopefully we have a bullet, by the way. Right, we do. <laughs> that would have been a hell of a way to find out it's a dead run. It's death by crocodile. You don't Why, say. Leon, I'll patch you up. Leon's a genius, isn't he? 
Apparently being shot in the chest doesn't make things easier. That too I owe you. Don't mention it. I just found out. John's dead. What? Never What's mind. Up? Online, thanks for stopping by. I hope you're doing good. Here. The sooner the better. Shit. That was a mistake. <laughs> So for anyone who's tuning in that's not a regular to the stream. This is literally my first ever Resident Evil 2 speedrun stream. I have one successful run in this game. And I just got it last night. I've only been learning the game for like a night or two. But I'm a huge Resident Evil fan. I love these games. And uh, on Halloween, I'm going to be streaming Resident Evil games all day. I'm going to do a full playthrough of Kendo's Cut as well, the mod. not going to be as fast as we could have been here because it's going to have less bullets. Yep, we're out of bullets. I have to rely on Ada a little bit. We're still way ahead of our PB, so. I'm pretty sure it's faster if you shoot him yourself, but we're out of bullets. Okay, so. I messed up where to go in here, oh, like, a lot. Go right, I think. Right. It was pretty close, Janzola, for sure. Then we go left. Nice dodge. Nice dodge again. Right, that's great. That's awesome. Yeah, we literally... I think we literally have one bullet. Oh, shit. Right, I think I'm still full health, right? Right. There is a... That's really good, by the way. I usually have to heal at this point. There's a room, though, that with the first aid in it that I'm, I am going for. Because it's a room full of frickin' liquors. That I'm not good at dealing with. We're going, it will just be a dead run if I don't heal. My practice run before the stream, I didn't heal and I died, and I would have PB'd by three minutes. So, we ain't losing another run to that. Yeah. 
That was extremely close to dying to the croc for sure. <laughs> Ada, Ada. <laughs> Come on, snap out of it. All right. I'm not like I don't know the best way to do this fight, by the way. So I'm about I will take damage here. I'm going to try and experiment a bit. This might be a terrible idea, but I'm going to try. That was fine, actually. I was going to say, I think we almost died, but nah, we're, we're good. That was better, I think. I think that was a better Don't fight than my PB. Ada. Come on. Wake up. Come on. I think this game came out in 1998. Someone could probably Google it, but I think it's 1998. So I think YouTube just told me when I selected the game on YouTube. <laughs> It was an extremely popular game at the time. Welcome back. Like it was one of those games where like tons of adults were hey, even playing it, you know. We're inside Umbrella's secret lab. I'll go find something to treat that wound. So just rest here in the meantime. The sin is like more of an adult game because it was scary for the time. <laughs> go. Save yourself. It is hilarious now. You, it's my job to look after you. Like retro horror games like this, they just become super fun. Like now, it's not scary at all because the graphics just look hilarious. I really enjoy being with you. It's kind of just fun, you know. I know I'm not capable of caring about anyone. Oh yeah. I don't want to. Even though you know the warning when you fire the game up about explicit violence and gore or whatever, it was such a huge deal made out of it. But I guess everyone was kind of an edgelord in the 90s as well. Right, so a heal in there, right? So that's one heal. I might not have needed to do that heal. But at this point... We might as well. So we go blue corridor. Let me go left. Yeah, like... Nowhere near as many games used to come out back in the day as what they do nowadays. We take this, okay? This is what I didn't take. That caused me to die. Because there's a bit that I can just run past, but... We will, we will just run past, but we might take a shitload of damage. That was probably where I should have re-equipped the, the Magnum thinking about it for time save. There's a part where I don't have the Magnum where I end up manually equipping it. And I, I can never remember like why I'm not doing it quite right. That was probably it, actually. Oh, no. Actually, I could have just done it there. Too much fucking talking, bro. I'm such an idiot. It doesn't matter, though. It doesn't matter. It's only like a second or something. We're gonna, we'll save. Almost went the wrong way. Right, if we go wide left here, we should be able to dodge these.
Alright, this is where things get sketchy. That was it, guys. That was the bit I was talking about. Absolute nightmare room to deal with. This isn't the easiest room either. Got a go left. Go this way. Shit. Did we do? Oh my god! I managed to dodge him. All right, that's awesome. I thought for sure we're going to mess that up. But I didn't. We just got to survive getting through that absolute toxic room a couple more times. Please. Why are you blocking me, bro? Well, that's not that bad. Quite a bit of RNG involved in that room. Okay. Shit. <laughs> How about not getting acid to the face? <laughs> Yikes. Right, blue corridor. Yeah. So I could have saved time by equipping the Magnum before this point at a time where we had to menu. So I think if we go Magnum and then we kill this guy, then we, we don't take that. We take the Magnum. Please game. There we go. We take the magnum bullets. Then we turn this on. Can I do this is the question. Oh, I almost did it. Right, we might, we might as well heal now on, on the way. Wait, we can't heal on the way out. Have healed. I should have picked that up on the on the way in. You, you oh well. My husband. I know what oh, they don't die. We're not on full health. Virus, didn't you? Never Might be a problem. This is my we might die legacy. on the final boss now. Where's that spy you I could have healed. Be like, if I picked you that heal up before I picked up the about. disc. I could have used the heal just you before I picked the item up after I took the damage from the zombies. <laughs> You're so gullible. But obviously, she's you're not supposed to take any damage, really, for a good run. The only reason why she came here is to so that that virus. might have cost us there. That's a lie. No, it's the truth. Is that the hope I've managed to survive getting through that crazy room one more time and then beating the final boss without full health? To get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. You're about to die anyway. What Get ready for the best bonk in the head ever. Bonk. <laughs> Get bonked. Leon's so confused right now. I was like, okay, I'll take it. Self destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat, the self destruct sequence has been activated. This sequence may not be aborted. All employees proceed to the emergency car at the bottom platform. All 
Get ready for the best cutscene in video game history. Or one of them. waiting for you, Leon. What are you doing? What? You know what this is about. So just hand over the G virus. I don't believe this. Annette was right. About everything. That's why I told you to leave without me, but you wouldn't <laughs> listen. Now hand it over. Don't make me shoot you. You can't do that. Can't do that. Ada! Ada! I've got you. Don't give up. Gee. G virus. <laughs> Unless she pulls over saying that. Over. Just let me go. Shut up. You're gonna make it. Shut up. It's too late, Leon. Gonna make it. Both know it. No. I promised you that we would escape. You just have to help me out here. I really wanted to escape. Oh, the vibes. This cutscene gets me every time. It's fucking awesome. No. Right? It's so good. I love this line, by the way. So, this is what everyone's been dying for. That's the most badass thing Leon ever does. So this is what everyone's been dying for. Just throws it off the edge like fuck it. I don't even care. It's bullshit. We could have tried to heal there. We could you know what? Try and heal. No, we can't try and heal. Oh my god, I'm wasting so much time. We'll, we'll die, chat. We, we'll, we can't do this. I need to heal. Oh god, don't die now. No! No! We died in the second to last room of the game, pretty much. <laughs> yeah. I guess I need to take both first aid sprays in the lab. I should have took that first aid spray before we grabbed the MO disc, like I said. And then I'll be pretty safe. Then we can just work it. And then it's easy PB. All right, I'm going to go to the bathroom. We're going to try again. All right, be right back. One sec.
I take offense to that, I don't die in the end. Ever. Oh, it's classic, the animation. Freeze. Thanks, Jan Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human! <sighs> Sorry about that. I thought you were one of them. Yeah, the reason I've been dying on speedruns lately is because What's going on in this town? no one on. is running half and home and I literally pioneering the strats. <laughs> By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. And I learned to speed on this game. Basically, me at hours ago. And we're still getting a fucking awesome pace. So the fact that we're dying where we're dying is not nothing. No problem. Oh, that was good. Like before Hearth and Home, I almost never died on on a New Game Plus speedrun. Oh yeah, that's way better as well. That was better as well. He didn't fall back up on one shot, but two shots is good still. The floor zombie died after three, which is awesome. Like the fact that my, my only successful speedrun right now of this game, which is literally just from two, a few hours on two nights in a row I've spent learning this run, that is all. That I already have a successful run, and it, if I submitted it, it actually wouldn't it wouldn't actually be last place either. And it we're about to PB in, in a way that will put me up almost a hundred spaces. It's fucking crazy. Located in the outskirts of oh, this things city. are going super good if we die or we Chris don't. And the other stars members discovered that Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the truth. But no one believed them. Not long after that, all this started to happen. Uh, uh. Hang in there. Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take like I said, at this you. point in this speedrun, the main thing is the uh, the actually this. remembering that now go. where to go. But it can be super hard to remember exactly where to go for a speedrun. Fine. The fact when that remembering everything is awesome. Just hold on. It's not taking much time at all to memorize, which I'm super happy about. Because there's other games I've been trying to learn to speedrun for months. And it's not gotten anywhere with it.
We're improving pretty much every time we play like do a run at this point, it feels like. Well we are. Times are improving very quick. I'm calming down a lot now as well. well I, was, I felt a bit nervous when I started the stream because it's like a game that lit, you know, <laughs> first time speedrunning on stream. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not going to find your brother here after all. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors, and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. I can't believe no! what's happening to this city. Fuck off, Claire. Oh my god. I guess you don't want to spam confirm and you that cook. I shouldn't even talk. Shouldn't spam confirm when you're that close to Claire, I guess. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yeah, the more, like, once you get super comfortable streaming speedruns of this game, like, I think I can get a super good time. We got bad RNG there as well. Fortunately. God. This part's scuffed so far. But there's so many other places with major time save that zero point in resetting or runs at this game at this point. Unless it's something like really bad that happens really early. It's kind of like we discuss sometimes on stream, like most like proper full time content creators that aren't like just speedrun people, like that end that are always end up being like the bigger content creators in a certain game. They're almost never at the top of the leaderboard because they got to focus on their content you know what i mean and um
for a content creator, I think I could actually get a time that's really good for this game. I needed to sneeze, but I couldn't mute the microphone. I'm sorry, chat. <laughs> I had to keep my hands on the keyboard. Apologies. On the bright side, that was actually a much better line in that corridor. <laughs> Oh god. Press the button when I shouldn't have. Oh, that's way faster. Oh, fucking for real? I'm not resetting. This whole RPD segment is scuffed, but... I'm just going to keep healing and just keep playing it out until we get the biggest time save. It looks like it's more than an easy two minutes than an easy three minutes that I was talking about, but... There's a way to get through this by going through the middle for sure. Or well, I think there is, not for sure. to heal here at some point but I have to figure out where I definitely pleased to myself being able to remember the route. 
as much as I love these games, I've always found it hard to remember the like best speedrun route for them. So many like corridors and stuff to remember, you know what I mean? facing the other way now oh my god see that's a room that wasn't a problem for me off stream it's become one now awesome glad to hear it down Thanks for stopping by, dude. I hope you're doing good. I'm absolutely hyped, like, to be streaming, speedrunning this. Absolutely hyped. I've always wanted to speedrun Resident Evil games. It's just been a matter of like, if I could actually have the time to actually manage to successfully learn how to do one. So I'm, I'm happy I finally have managed to learn one. Literally, as of like last night, I have one successful run in the game that I got last night. I'm playing PC version right now. I'll, I'll explain during this next cutscene. Because you might be interested in what I'm about to say. If you ever wanted to replay this. Alright. So, um, basically I'm actually playing a modded version of the game that is actually just the PC version. It's called Resident Evil 2 Rebirth or Biohazard 2 Rebirth. Sorry about that. If you Google the uniform, like the Rebirth version it. or like Source Next Rebirth, like Resident Evil 2 Source Next Rebirth or just oh, Resident Evil 2 Rebirth. Basically, the very latest version of the game what did come out. Here? In, in uh, I think the early 2000s in Japan, so that way where it was actually patched with some improvements, uh, and somebody has modded that Japanese version to make it seamlessly work on on modern hardware, so it just runs on anything now. Um, and the, the mod is pretty substantial. It doesn't change anything about the game. It's all just making the game work with modern graphics drivers and stuff like that um but it, like it has controller support and everything like it's absolutely amazing the guy's called gemini that made it anyone who plays a lot of resident evil these days the old ones still will, will know but the guy is a freaking legend for, ma for making these rebirth things and the this the same ver he's done it actually for the whole original trilogy Ada, wait. So you can play the OG. This is the, this is the OG PC version of the game, like for real. But it just works on modern hardware, which is so awesome. And uh, these versions of the game, must be ben, right? uh, partly Get why the game now. still has like a thriving modern scene, which will play want? some Resident I'm Evil mods here. on Halloween. I wanted to learn this for Halloween, but it was going so well, I just figured I might as well stream if I'm going to PB. Ben, you told the city officials that you knew something. But it even has a mod launcher and everything. On, didn't you? Super easy. What did you tell them? 
I'll play with keyboard just because it's faster, I'm basically. To find my boyfriend. His name's John. But I, I, I've learned how to play with a keyboard just to do the speed run. Like, usually I'll play with a controller. Six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Oh, yeah, it's amazing. Like, the, some okay, of the people in the community are incredible. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have but it right anyone here. who has access to a PC, but like this, to it this should cell. run on pretty much anything, I, I would assume. And uh, I wouldn't look like I would ever encourage piracy, what but these games are so old right now that, that they're all on like I said, uh, archive.org. So, get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, just I'm saying, not going it's like I'm the only just free, you know. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But anyway, but this is a specific version of Rebirth of that has been modded for speedrunners. Where it essentially just prevents, I think. I think what it does is oh, prevent please. certain settings from being changed. Right, I'm going. So that you don't break in the rules. And the moderators know because... Oh shit, that was slow. There's a watermark that's added to the main menu that says it's the speedrun edition, so moderators know that you're running the speedrun edition. Um, I know, you know, we also use an, an auto splitter right now as well, which is lots of legit games in the speedrun community have auto splitters, but Valheim obviously doesn't. Um, Oh shit, I could have skipped that. What am I doing? I need to get my head straight. I'm making silly mistakes on this run. This was better than my... EB, what's going on with the splits here? I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. This stopped working or something? It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? Give me a boost. I'll go and check. Have I messed something up? Did I go the wrong way? So the auto split is waiting for a door I didn't do. The auto split is not working right now, chat. Play it, play it out and see if I actually did do the route wrong. There's probably no point in resetting if I don't know what I did wrong. If I did something wrong, I need to know what it is, don't I? Trying to think. I mean, um, we'll we'll flip in no. That's for sure. Well, if if I mess the route up, we're gonna know about it because I won't have something that I need. <laughs> Trying to think. We'll just play it out. Maybe the auto splitter is bug. Is would be new to me if that it ever happened because I. Not aware of that happening to me ever, but I during practice runs. Kind of annoying though, because Leon, can you hear me? 
Ada, did you find anything? Right here. My PB won't be like accurate. Hey, I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. Nah, I mean. Ada, wait! You can do the route however you want. But the auto splitter is going to expect doors to happen in a certain way. But it's but the auto splitter is programmed for the fastest route anyway. But, but I don't even recall doing anything. We'll just have to play until we fail, essentially, so that we know what happened. Because if I just reset now, I won't learn anything, will I? I feel confident that I did things right. I went up and managed to go on the right side of that liquor. I feel confident that I didn't miss anything. I could be completely wrong. But I feel like the splitter was probably just bugged. Oh no, I'm not grabbing from behind. That wasn't that bad. You can get around this guy somehow, but not like that, clearly. So we always end up in a situation at this point. It's fine because there's a first date at the other side of this. PB was this rough in this corridor. I really need to improve this part of the game. Like, I obviously... I've, I've memorized the route. The... Like... To the point where I'm pretty confident that I know always where to go now. Which is the biggest hurdle. But I, I, I haven't, like, memorized any lines or anything. And the lines... Some of the lines that I do know are just, like... In rooms where the line allows you to oh my god that's not good allows you to avoid zombies <sighs> so like it's worth trying to le learn those kind of lines because they can obviously save your life I'm sure the auto split is just bugged, which is a shame that that's actually a thing because it's been so reliable for me. It makes sense, I guess. Uh, ultimately the time that like this game has in-game time anyway and that is that is what we're 
keys to submit and stuff. Although it might be an invalid run without these auto splits, because I think they do request it. But I guess we'll just have to. If this is, ends up being our PB, I just guess I'll just have to submit my next PB. You know what I mean? What matters right now is practice. Pretty sure I've not messed up. No, it's, I messed up. <laughs> yep, I know what we did wrong. We didn't get the crank. All right. That's fine. We go again. At least uh, it isn't the auto splitter messing up because I would hate for that to be a thing that could happen. You know what I mean? Honestly, I'm usually so crap at memorizing stuff in video games. I'm very Hold impressed with myself that I've been able to it. memorize this route. So if my memory's starting to fall apart a bit today, then that's fine. Sorry about that. I thought you were I've managed to memorize it so fast. I'm What's like very happy with town? myself. Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong. The entire city was infested with zombies. It's like the last time I learned speedrunner game that I started streaming was Tribes of Midgard. And when I first started the runs, I would say to chat, like, oh, sorry, I can't talk to chat quite as much. That's not bad, actually. But yeah, I would say like, sorry, I can't t talk to chat as much. You know, I need to like remember stuff. Eventually, I'll just rem know it so well that it's like muscle memory. I don't have to think. Bit of bad RNG there with that zombie placement, but it's okay. That's perfect. Perfect little boss segment there. Probably saved a few seconds in that boss. No joke. Basically, right? Depending, I don't know if it, it might, it seems like it might be based on exactly where you stand. But sometimes it's faster if you shoot that zombie three times on the floor, it's faster than if you allow it to grab your ankle. And then you run past her and then you shoot the other guy in the foot and you want him to get knocked back. But sometimes she takes more than four shots or something to die and you end up getting bit anyway. And sometimes the guy standing up doesn't get knocked back with one shot. It might take a couple of shots. Has been cancelled. What happened? About two months ago. You can see though that there was this all the time save in our involving zombies splits in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other stars members <laughs> discovered that I appreciate that Thomas Umbrella was behind everything. Um, they risked their lives. Yeah, Japanese truth, is faster, but, but no one <laughs> believed them. Not long after that, we will do a story playthrough on Halloween. Happened. 
and then a story playthrough of a mod Hang in there. and some speedruns. So basically my plan on Halloween is to do a really long stream where I play Resident Evil all day. And we will do some story playthroughs where we read everything and make sure everyone knows the story just to familiarize some of our community members with the franchise that might not know the story and stuff. Fine, but I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. And I'll, I'll put them up on YouTube as well in case anyone can't make the stream. It was yeah, that it is that is what I was hinting at. <laughs> no. Oh, that's not good. Pressed too many times on that thing. Um. Yeah, I plan to stream Resident Evil games all day for Halloween because I always play Resident Evil games for Halloween because it's one of my favorite franchises. Probably my number one favorite video game franchise, actually. But I thought it'd be cool if I could learn a speedrun before Halloween and I thought it would take me a while to manage to learn one. But actually I managed to learn this one much faster. So, and I'm so close to getting a PB that I just figured I might as well stream it. But if once we get a PB in this tonight, guys, I will I will go change to Valheim if I have time. Continue the grind for PB in that too. I just want a PB in this first. Ryder, what's up, dude? Let's talk about the stream, mate. I hope you're doing good. I've done this wrong, chat. Alright, we reset again. I'll try and concentrate a bit more this time. Alright. Freeze! Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human! I collected something early, which would wait waste Sorry, a bit of time. I thought you were one of them. What's going on in this town? Hold on. I don't have a clue. By the time I noticed something was wrong, the entire city was infested with zombies. It's because we've done a few runs in a row now, I'm getting them confused. Perfect, pretty much. Well, not quite perfect, but really good. there anyway uh, oh she died in two. Oh, and he took two so same difference still good though no fuck alright that's fine that's fine 
We got good RNG on the train, on the bus, so. Still getting greens in the splits. Still be Gucci. That's right, Mitch. I love this game. Stopping by the stream, mate. I hope you're doing good. Who, who are you? Oh, you must be the new guy, Leon. Sorry, but it looks like your party has been cancelled. What happened? About two months ago, there was this incident involving zombies in a mansion located in the outskirts of this city. Chris and the other STARS members discovered that <laughs> Umbrella was behind everything. They risked their lives to reveal the truth. Sergeant Thomas of Delta but Squad is no one of my one first ever followers on Twitch, guys. Not long after that, all this started to happen. The chat OG uh, right there. Uh, hang in there. Don't worry about me. Just rescue the survivors in the other rooms. Here, take this key card. You should be able to unlock the doors in the hall with this. Now go. But just go. Fine, but I'm coming back for you. Just hold on. True. All right, we're getting time save here, so that's good. Here's what we didn't do on the other run. No, not this, actually. Oh my God. The fact that I thought that that was it is not a good sign. Just saying. What? I need to get my head in the game. I'm coming back because I pressed the button. This is our first time in here. I keep thinking I've placed the medallion already. I'm getting confused with our runs. We can still PB. It's interesting because this is the first game I've ever tried to speed run. That isn't just like some randomly generated thing. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, what am I doing? This is wrong again. Idiot. Nah, I'm not resetting anyway because we got potentially minutes we can still save. I'm just getting progressively worse at this point. It's like compared to the other games that are speedrun. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like it's um because it's the same every time. I keep getting confused because after doing multiple runs now, like with a few, obviously we're not at a successful run, but after a few resets, I'm now There's getting no confused between different attempts. You know what I mean? Let's split up, look for any the problem, I'm not, I'm not used to having to think like that. Right. They usually speed run One last thing. randomly Here's generated games. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens.
I mean, might as well have finished do, doing this before, but the point is that I need to remember the actual route. You know what I mean? Not just some scuffed version of it. Now we go to the back wall to dodge the... Oh, this guy's in a bad position for us. Unlucky. We'll be able to start gaining time soon. What? There's a lot of reds here, but... Uh, this is one of the things we forgot to do on a previous run. go and get this gem see we're catching up to our reds now we'll be back to getting greens in no time Concentrate a bit. Get that. Pace up. as well and this guy oh god we can maybe gain a second or two here We are catching up though.
No! I was trying to do it without stopping to save time. Oh yeah, this game is very competitive. The OG Resident Evil games are very competitive speedrun games. Resident Evil games in general tend to be pretty competitive speedrun games because it's a huge kind of tradition of the franchise to speedrun. Uh, well, we didn't save any time there. Because like since the very first game, they always had an, an in-game time. I told you when you finished the game how long it took you to do it. It's like always been a tradition in Resident Evil games. That was actually better. That was one of our best attempts at this room. The cut scene that you can skip so short, it's hard to get the skip in. But I did. But like you should not see the cut scene. If I do it right. Thanks, Jens, all. Appreciate it, dude. Appreciate the lurks. to be on the other side of him there oh my god please don't kill us the small chance we die soon hopefully not though not too bad but this room could go a lot better <laughs> all right we we take this herb because we're on orange caution which is very yikes Officially back on time save now? I think we are. Hell yeah. We caught up. I knew we could do it. Take this.
Yeah, we lost a little bit of time healing, but still ahead. It was totally worth doing. These dogs just seem RNG, and they never used to hit me. Enemy placement and stuff is quite often a little bit RNG in Resident Evil. So during this cutscene, I just want to explain a few things. I've been a huge fan of Resident Evil for a long time. For anyone who doesn't know, I'm a world record Valheim speedrunner mainly. But I make like challenge videos and guides and stuff as well. And I've been wanting to branch out onto the speedruns. I recently learned to speedrun Tribes of Midgard. I'm loving running that game as well. Um, but... I've always wanted to try Resident Evil speedruns. It's just found it really hard to learn them. And I spent a couple... This one, I've managed to learn in just like a few hours, essentially. Like, it's a couple of nights where I was working on learning the run. Um, and I managed to get one successful run last night. And the reason I started learning it recently is because I thought it would be cool for Halloween to do a load of Resident Evil content for Halloween. And I thought it would take me ages to learn the run. But after like just like a couple of nights of just messing with it for a few hours, basically. Managed to get a successful run down, which is further than I've got in trying to learn the run for any other Resident Evil game. Um, And I could tell that I was like about to PB when I was doing another practice run. I was like, if I'm going to PB, I might as well stream it. So... I decided to start streaming this a bit early, but on Halloween, I will be streaming Resident Evil games all day uh, and some mods and stuff as well. But because I was so close to PB in in my practice run again, I thought Let me guess. I might as well just bent, right? stream it whilst the route Get is fresh in my head. Because the main thing that's difficult at this point when I'm still what new to the want? game is memorizing the route. Is this the guy? Ben, you told the city officials that you knew something about what's been going on. But I'll be happy if I can get a time that's less than an hour. And who the heck are you? That's an awesome time to start with. My boyfriend. His name's John. He was working for a branch office of Umbrella. See you, mate. Thanks for stopping by, mate. Have a good one. disappeared six months ago. I heard a rumor that he's here in the city. I don't know anything. And even if I did, why would I want to tell you? Okay, I say we leave him in there. Does anyone know where they put the key to this cell? I have it right here, officer. But I'm not about to leave this cell. Those zombies aren't the only things crawling around out there. What was that? Like I said, I'm not leaving this cell. Get out of here before you lead it right to me. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. I'm the only cop left alive in this building. What? Look, if you want to live, then you're going to have to leave with me. But do you even know how to get out of the city? There's a kennel in the back of the building. Inside the kennel is a manhole. Go through and it'll lead you to the sewer entrance, but it won't be easy. It won't be easy. All right, I'm going. I really do to not get hit by the spiders this time. Hell yeah. That was good. No! I was about to say we might be able to save some time in there. Then I messed it up. 
We did save some time. <laughs> I don't think I've introduced myself yet. My name's Leon. I'm with the RPD. It's a dead end. You think we can get upstairs through this shaft? If I if I PB in this game check. tonight, guys, we'll go back to doing Valheim Hearth and home runs. Okay, we only equip our gun. Ada runs faster without it. Fuck me. How are we getting bad dog RNG in general? Right, there's definitely time save here to be had. That should be much better than my PB. Oh my god, go. Hell yeah. Lots of time save. Leon, can you hear me? There's a certain Aiden, point in this PB where I almost anything. died and I had to backtrack to get some right ammo here. and heal. If we can avoid doing the same thing, we should instantly be on pace for a sub hey, one hour. I can't reach the ventilation hole. I'm going to have to find another way around. I'll catch up with you later. What? Ada, wait! But sub one hour would be amazing for our second ever successful run. No, I always hesitate on which wall to be on on this bit. It doesn't really matter though. Good. Stay away, Licker, please. Take this, I think. No, we already did. I don't know if we saved or lost time or what there. It's supposed to be faster, but you're also supposed to not get hit. Oh, hell yeah! The first time I managed to get past this horde this quick. Yeah, I don't know how we dodge this guy. Oh, hell yeah. 
first time I managed to dodge those guys like that on a speed run. I think we gotta take this though. Because we probably will die if not. Look at the time save, guys. Insane time save. Because that is the bit. With all the zombies that I managed to dodge. I was on danger, so I had to shoot him. So this is hype. It's gonna not screw it up now. No, really? Oh, okay, we got past that guy, that's fine then. My God. Hell yeah. Oh my God. Not hell yeah. Don't get trapped. The fence. <laughs> right, we're on pace for sub one hour. Just don't lose time now. Don't die. Should say that too. We gotta equip the magnum whilst we do this. No, wrong thing. Alright, whatever. That's still better than my menu in I think and my PB. But obviously not perfect. We can probably still gain a lot of time if things continue to go well. Okay, boss fight coming up. No! Get away! No! No! Ben. Can you still hear me? Come on, answer. Damn. I don't believe this. I almost got the story. <coughs> ben. <laughs> Bitter irony. The chief of police. A co-conspirator. Get that scum. Make him pay. Hang in there, Ben. Oh, my chest! It's burning! What's wrong? Gotta make sure I don't make any mistakes oh, with where I go. I'm <laughs> just thinking, chat. Thanks for watching the stream, though, you guys. Really appreciate it. Appreciate anyone like, who's giving me a chance like playing a game they don't normally watch me play.
Ada, wait! Hey! Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Like, if I want, as a content creator, to have longevity, I've got to be able to diversify, you know? And for me, like, everything's got to be a passion project. And I freaking love Resident Evil. So it's a huge passion project to be able to speed on this game. I'm so excited as well to stream. I want to realize that I've managed to learn how to do the run. I was just so hyped for it. All right, Birkin time. I think it's a little bit RNG how many bullets it takes to kill him. Isn't it difficult to learn the animation exactly of when he's actually dead and i also need to go on his left side instead of the right side so i don't get stuck on his tail what was that all about running off like that was reckless and stupid those zombies are everywhere so we changed to the pistol whilst we inserted those i was there leon chest pieces so we can use it as an for the officer, it's my job to look out um but we're not going to get what's it called if we don't work together the train car okay. thing the monorail thing All right we'll do this your way for now and uh for the croc obviously so we don't waste magnum bullets Right, that was the best I've done this little room because I always forget it exists. Leon, that woman was. I have to talk to her. Yeah, I think my Ada, uh, Ada segment was pretty good in my PB. That's the best one of that corridor I've done today. Oh, that line was pretty nice, actually. For me. from Chicago who came to assist the T-Virus research used his girlfriend's name as his password. Ada and John, I believe. How did you know? Who are you? Annette Birkin. My husband is the man responsible for the creation of the T-Virus. William Birkin. What? John's dead. He became one of those zombies. My condolences. And although I regret this, you will be joining him. Sure. I can't remember if I actually I did I, like skip this cutscene fast enough. G virus, it's capable of creating um, in my PB or not. Its potential is at a certain point, I was like, I don't necessarily care about being the then fastest because the creature in the I'm just good that I've managed to remember the route. Precisely, 
it was my first successful my husband, playthrough, like and it's using a speedrun route. None of this would have happened if they hadn't tried to steal his research away from him. So those rats were the carriers of the virus. As a result of his virus-induced transmutation, William should have lost any prior memories he had as a human. Yeah, I lost less than a second by going on Birkin's tail, so it shows that we're probably a couple of seconds ahead actually there for Joe on the left side. And create offspring. No. Too bad. Yeah, we actually did save time. That's what I thought. Ada? A bit we normally get hit by that spider. Trying to think if we should heal or not. Probably should. We can still get sub one hour. One and a bit seconds. For that heal. Looking very good so easier. far, chat. Quiet, Leon. I'll patch you up. As long as I don't die. And I can That's save a little good. more time for a few don't seconds mention. here and there for the rest of the run. Well, pretty Just confidently. Could be on pace for sub one hour. Which I'll be hyped Never about. Mind. Let's just get out of here. And if we get it, then we'll Sooner move on to playing some Valheim for a bit. Mm -hmm. 
probably save some more time here as well. Oh, fuck. Oh, well, rip. The chance we still save some time, but I doubt it. Definitely save time here, actually. I think I was out of bullets, maybe, on my PB at this point. Alright, so we go right. Uh. We go left. Uh. Dodge there. Got dodge there though. That should be faster, I think, than my PB. By a lot. Yeah. messed up a bit there it should still be a lot faster yep it is hell yeah we're pulling ahead now getting more comfortable to be a sub one hour we only need to save like two two minutes and four seconds Shit. what i'm doing don't throw this now <laughs> So save it like three minutes makes me a lot more comfortable. But obviously. Gotta make sure we don't mess up. Ada, Ada. Come on, snap out of it. All right, I think we can do this faster, even.
I think that was much better actually. Far from perfect, but much better, I think. Don't die on me, Ada. Come on. Alright, let's not die in like this second to last room of the Come game, on. basically. <laughs> let's not do that again. Welcome back. Oh. Oh. I'm going to hey, have easy. to heal here, aren't I? So this segment lab. is where I, I have to not to treat that wound. try so and, and get overconfident. I, I have to actually play this part safe. safe. So I'm not good enough Go. at the end bit yet. I told so I need to make sure I heal. But We're going to if you stay with me. take I both first aid sprays. Capable of caring about anyone, but I don't want to lose you. We're leaving this place together. Wait here for me. I'll be right back. Right, that's definitely going to end up being faster. your blue corridor your left This is why I wanted more like three minutes of time save for those little mistakes. Magnum here. Save a tiny bit of time, even though it wasn't the best menu in. actually really good. I'm saving the first aid in case we get hit on the way back. myself Ooh. 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 
Okay, that was good. Much better. Much, that's kind of a complicated room for me, I feel. As far as not getting bit. Right, we've got to be on the ball. If we take any hit, we should just use the first aid spray. Because these things deal a lot of damage. Stick to the plan. Stick to the plan. All right. So that was mistake number one that we fixed by getting that first aid spray. And I was in a similar situation. We are getting close. Very close. Uh, we take both these things. This is the other thing. The other mistake to fix. Okay, now there's I think we can do this. Still get away with being fine. Oh my god, dude. Uh, not world record, just my PB. I only just learned this game of, like a couple of nights ago, a speed run. Like I literally got my first ever successful run last night. So we're three minutes ahead of my personal best, which I've only had one successful run. But I'm pretty proud that my first successful run is wouldn't even be last place if I submitted it. But this run should be like way above last place. So super happy considering. Why she came here I just started running this game, virus. making really good progress, so I'm kind of hyped about it. No, it's the <laughs> truth. I discovered Thanks for talking about the stream, though, Dave. Hope you're doing good, mate. She specifically got close to John and became his girlfriend to get information about Umbrella. That can't be. I know her. Ada wouldn't do something like that. If you don't want to believe it, I don't really care. Records about, about 48 minutes. Anyway. I can't remember the exact what seconds. Happened? Maybe 4804 or something. It's frick is absolutely nuts anyway. Oh nice one dude. Thanks for stopping by. Alright. The self-destruct sequence has been activated. Repeat the We could die still before the run's activated. over, so. To play this All right. To the car at the nice, I'm glad you got did. This is literally my first ever Resident Evil 2 speedrun stream, so. I've been waiting for you. I speedrun Valheim and Tribes of Midgard mostly. What are you doing? You know Those are the only two games I know, but I just learned just this one. So hopefully we're gonna be doing some more streams and videos about this now. Annette was right. About everything. That's why I told you to leave without me, but you wouldn't listen. I've always been a huge fan of Resident Evil and Resident Don't Evil speedrunning though. You. you can't do that. Ada! 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 I've got you. Don't give up. This cutscene is just epic every time. Leon, it's over. Just let me go. Shut up. You're gonna make it. It's too late, Leon. They both know it. No! I promise. 
promised you that we would escape. Oh yeah, it's way better. You just have to help me out here. I really wanted to escape with you, Leon. Escape from. Gonna make sure I concentrate and I don't die. <laughs> exactly, Doru. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Remember, guys. Ada! The last boss fight is not super easy. It's a little bit of orange team fault. No. no. That's my favorite bit. Hell yeah. Throw that shit away, Leon. Oh. Oh my god, go the right way, please. Push this guy, and then we shoot this guy. And we should be able to dodge these guys. Oh my god, we did it. Right, well, this, I mean, we've got to kill the last boss now, but that actually went very well. Ah, come on, we can do it. No! I'm dead, I think. If he if he charges me, I'm now dead. I think I'm dead. Oh my god, I didn't die. Oh my god! We're literally like that re reload. If that didn't go through, we would have been fucking dead. Run. Run, Leon. Oh, look, we're, we're crawling to the finish line on danger. If anyone ends up watching this video that watches Resident Evil Speedruns, they've probably never seen this before. Go, Leon! Yes! <laughs> Hell yeah! Let's see the in-game time. 59.03 Let's fucking go! This is literally my second ever successful run of this game. I've only put a few hours after the stream two nights in a row to learn this route. And we're already at sub one hour. I'm super pleased with that. Hello, YouTube. <laughs> Thanks a lot for watching. Hope you enjoyed this run. If you'd like to support the content, you can do so on Patreon at patreon.com slash Nick That's what keeps the content alive. And uh, you can also get access to my private Valheim server as well. Donations also help a lot. Oh my god.
the adrenaline. Oh. What sort of call? Literally limping across the finish line. Yep. Oh, I'm so hyped after that run. That's so awesome, chat. What's up, Cole? Thanks for stopping by the stream, dude. Hope you're doing good. Just got in after a long day, relaxing with a cold beer, enjoying watching your first ever Resident Evil 2 stream. Hope all is well with you, GG, on the new PB. Everything's great with me. Thanks, Cole. I appreciate that. Does that actually put me in 138th? Holy shit. My previous PB was like 300 and something. Does that really put us in 138th place? There's like, I don't like, um, if you're like a, con a content creator, being in, in, in like the top 100 is like pretty fucking legit. I gotta submit this run. I gotta submit this run. Yeah, you're, yeah, yeah, you're probably right. You're probably right. I can actually, I mean, I can check, can't we, before we play some Valheim. Um... Fifty nine oh three. Oh no, it's uh still still it's inside the top three hundred. So fifty nine. O three puts us uh, 294, basically, is where it would put us. Which is pretty fucking amazing, considering we've just started running the game. It's literally, that's our second run. So the fact that it's uh, anywhere, you know, the fact that it's not even like not even close to last place really is flipping awesome. But anyway, it's easy to see how we have like tons of time save and stuff. Uh yeah, there is a link in the description on YouTube to the speedrun page. But still like it's amazing ranking. Even that's amazing ranking uh after just two runs. I think we can get a really good time. But, uh, anyway, uh, let's go change screens real quick. And, um, oh, in fact, I should probably wrap the stream up. And if I'm going to change for, to Valheim so that this exists as its own VOD, on YouTube. Yeah. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I'm gonna wrap this one up. Um, I'll put some Resident Evil 2 music on to wrap it up as we, we celebrate. Um, but thanks a lot for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I'm going to end this stream, guys. Because this is our Resident Evil 2 speedrun stream. And I want people to like get the notification for a new stream. Because I stream on YouTube and Twitch at the same time. Um, so this is the end of our Resident Evil 2 speedrun stream. Um, so just because the I'm mostly known for Valheim. So people that got this notification won't stop by. But when I restart the stream playing Valheim. Um, like they'll obviously stop by. So I'm going to end the stream. Then I'm going to quickly get some food, okay? Because I might as well eat because we're about at the halfway point anyway, right? And then I'll restart the stream 
after I've eaten some food uh, with Valheim like world record slash PB attempts uh, for the post Hearth and Home new game plus round of secrets as well bosses. So thanks a lot for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed today's stream. I was so excited to share with you guys like one of my favorite video games ever. Uh, probably my favorite Resident Evil game. Resident Evil is like my favorite franchise. So thanks so much to everybody that's a regular of my content that I you know would rather be watching me play Valheim but you stop by and you watch me play Resident Evil anyway. I really appreciate that. That means a lot. Um, there are all links in the description on YouTube for how to support the content but I'm going to go. Thanks a lot for watching. Um, I will be back live very soon. Should be less than an hour. I'm literally just going to end the stream, get some food and then restart the stream playing Valheim. All right. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I hope you have a great night and uh, I'll see you very shortly uh, for some Valheim speedruns. All right. See you soon, guys. Bye. Have a good one.